there are two passages in the throat of the cat. There is the respiratory passage for air. Food will go from the oropharynx to the laryngopharynx to the larynx, which is composed of a number of cartilages, into the trachea to the lungs. But food also passes through the oropharynx and laryngopharynx, but then passes through the esophagus to the stomach. This creates a problem in that if food were to go into the wrong passageway, into the larynx and trachea, it could become lodged and could uh, cause an animal to suffocate. And so therefore, the larynx includes among its multiple cartilages a piece of elastic cartilage known as the epiglottis. When we swallow, or when a cat swallows, part of the swallowing reflex is that the epiglottis, because it is composed of elastic cartilage, will close over the opening to the larynx known as the glottis. Thus, food has no choice. It is shunted away from the airway and into the esophagus to protect us, whether cats or humans, uh, from swallowing food into the airway, which could block the airway and cause us to suffocate.